How to make a parametric modular kitchen casework in Revit. Part 9, base unit, 3 drawers. Let's start. Duplicate base unit 1 door from our previous tutorial. Copy, paste, and rename the file. Base unit, 3 drawers. <coughs> Okay, open the file. Go to reference level. Delete the shelf the parameter. We don't need this. Delete this reference plane. Go to front elevation delete the shelves delete the dimension okay go to family types okay delete double shelves delete the single shelf delete the door and delete the shelf depth parameter Okay, next, delete these family types, with 30, with 90, delete with 90, delete with 45, the with 30, okay, keep the with 60, and rename it to BU. 3D or base unit 3 drawers. Okay. Next. Check. Okay. Next. Create reference plane. Draw a two horizontal reference plane. Dimension Select this reference plane And this reference plane Okay Select the two reference plane Select the dimension Create new parameter Type Door height 1 Okay, select the dimension, new parameter, door height 2. Okay, go to family types, move the door height parameter. Okay, move below the countertop thickness okay change the value of door height 1 to 263 for 3 equal door height apply okay next go to create let's create a reference plane for the 6 millimeter gap Dimension Se Select Change the dimension to 6 millimeter Lock Select reference plane Copy Ok Dimension Select And lock the dimension Select the door, unlock the bottom, okay, move the arrow, select the door, move, okay, align, select this reference plane, select the bottom of the door, lock, select the door, 
copy okay align select this reference plane select the top of the door and lock select this reference plane select the bottom of the door lock okay select the door copy okay align select this reference plane select the bottom of the door lock okay select this reference plane select the top of the door lock okay change the graphic display to realistic let's check the 3d okay family types let's change the depth to 800 apply go back to 650 let's change the width to 800 okay now let's go to front elevation select align select the center reference plane select the center of the door lock select the center reference plane select the center of the door lock okay back to 3d family types change the width to 600 okay okay let's check double check family types okay good uh, save the family load it into our sample project okay insert space to rotate the family okay let's select the unit mirror and select the space okay done thank you